wanted open plan, we wanted it to be 21st century, but also mid-century as well. And the good thing about dealing with um, integrity was they listened to what I wanted to do. And at no point was I told no. There was always, there might have been negotiations around certain things, but there was always a solution. There was always a way to, to get through it. And that, that started at the design process right through to handover. Mm. Is when you walk in, you've got the petition there, which kind of gives you a little bit of sense of what's on the other side. You come up a couple of stairs, four and a half meter height there with the rake ceilings. Mm. And then because our block was a little bit problematic in terms of aspect, we put that courtyard at the front northwest corner. So in winter, that's a sun trap and it communicates directly off the, the main living area. So Perfect. if you want to go outside and catch some sun, you can. And this is one of the few things that the drafts person who drew up the house made the garage a foot longer, well, 300 millimetres longer. And we're really pleased about that because it um, means that we've got a lot more storage space. So we've got two other bedrooms up here and they've got the rake ceilings as well. And that was another thing that sold us on integrity. Other builders were wanting to put in scissor trusses, which basically means that you don't end up with the same height um, because you actually got a truss. So integrity was very keen to be um, true to the mid-century modern feel by putting in a full rake. So we've ended up with very high ceilings, mm -hmm. but we were still able to incorporate flat ceilings over the upstairs bathroom the ensuite and the walk-in wardrobe and this walk-in linen cupboard so that we've got our ducted air conditioning sort of all housed in there. I love the whole house, but the comments we get from people are that this worked really, really well in terms of the design and and the feel you get up here, but also I think the fact that we've gone with a darker colour just in our suite, um, just to give it a bit of a sense of drama. But we wanted something which, you know, we've got the rake ceilings in here as well, and we wanted to be able to connect the bathroom or ensuite with the bedroom living area, but we also wanted to be able to close it off. So these doors are actually solid core uh, cavity sliders oh, or pocket nice. doors. Yep. So if one of us has to get up early, to go to work or I have to go to Sydney for business meetings or whatever, yeah, I can get up and close the doors. And because they're solid, it, it cuts out a lot of the, the noise. That's and then- builder's recommendation. Yeah, yeah, Don actually yeah. said, let's put solid cores in, which was good. And um, and then I can use the ensuite, or one of us can use the ensuite and the, and the walk-in wardrobe without disturbing the other one who gets to sleep in.